Hello mortals. Welcome to another awful chess game, played between Ali Reza and Nepo. This is the 11th round of the FIDE candidates 2022. Ali Reza lost the first game with the black pieces against Nepo, and is now seeking revenge against him. In order to do that, his preparation was playing 268 hyperbolic games, 5 a.m. in the morning on Lee Chess, a few hours before his match. Don't believe me? Careful human. I never lie. Link to these games is on the description of this video. So, let's watch how this game went. Knight to f6, the Petrov's defense. This is a great defense if you have a passion for draws. I hope white doesn't play knight take c5, the main move. Knight take c5, the main move. I hate humans. c4, discouraging d5. The main move was d4, getting ready to accept a very boring position. Although c4 is not the best move, it is acceptable. Maybe this game will not end in a draw after all. Moving the pawn twice in a row on move 6, is not usually a great idea, but not in this case, it's very important to kick this knight from e4 first, before putting the pawn on d4. I would say nice try. But he is obviously just copying my ideas. f3, weakening the king side, weakening the dark squares, very dubious. I wonder what his idea is. Bishop to e2 was much better. Aha! That's why he played f3, to execute this bad idea. One good and obvious move for white would be f4, kicking the pony from e5, pony goes to c4, b3, attacking the pony again, pony to e3, with a discovery attack on white's pony and attacking the queen, bishop takes c3, rook takes c3, and after bishop to g1, white is better. The bad plan is turning into a losing plan very quickly. I think White just found the two worst possible moves that don't blunder a piece immediately. Very impressive. Humans really can't accept when a plan is bad. G5? I guess he just likes pushing pawns. White is now completely lost. Although black is down an exchange. The bishop pair and three pawns is more than enough to win this game. The good thing about bishop to b3 is that the it helps the game end quicker. White resigned. Finally the torture is over. If bishop to g2, rook to h3 is mate in 1. So after white move the king, bishop takes d5 would attack both the knight and the rook, so white would lose another piece. If you enjoy this video, consider checkmating the like and subscribe button. If you have any suggestion, just put it in the comments and I will do it. Or not. See you later or not.